and what will happen next and how I react to the situation. So, so let's address that really quick. Busy day? No. Not busy? Super relaxed. Yeah. yeah. Vanessa is the, the hero of the crisis for me at least. She's like, she's working 24 seven since all of this started. And no, she's not a doctor or she's not saving lives, but she's working for Education First, a company that sends young adults abroad for language courses worldwide. So you can imagine how screwed they are by no travel being allowed and every country locking down. She's now responsible for a thousand kids trying to get them back home. And the EU just closed all borders. So it's, it's really tough to find flights. It's really tough to deal with the parents. They're of course all panicking way more than they should. Her working day just exploded. It's like 50 times more the workload. And she's still holding up. So I'm very, very proud. This crisis affects some people a lot more, some people less, some are even profiting. So I think it's important now to be social. And if you make more, try to help others. If you have the time, use it. If you're having a tough time, don't be ashamed to, to ask for help. I wanna just go outside for a run as long as I'm actually allowed to. So this area right here, the very, very city center, it's empty. Finally, people are following. Like, there's not even a percent of people out here. Apple store is closed. All other stores are closed. The only ones that are busy are the construction workers. I don't know if this is due to it being still early and they might all open up. But I see already people over there preparing for the restaurants. They're allowed to open for just four, five, six hours and with one meter of distance. It's crazy, it's weird. It feels like this uh, 21 days zombie movie kind of shit. I'm legend and that kind of stuff. But I still think this is not enough to really stop it and get over this really, really fast. Anyways, 2.5 kilometers so far, as fast as never before. Trying to do the same back home for a new record so wish me luck back at the studio another beautiful day i ran the 5k as fast as never before so i'm really proud vanessa was still sitting at home and working really hard it hurts a little seeing her like that i hope this will be over soon but probably not so i will today try to work two hours less in the studio go back home support her a little as much as i can and i think it's time for some some real talk because people ask me if i will still keep on doing this vlog and what will happen next and how i react to the situation so so let's address that really quick so first up let's get it out of the way straight up the vlog will continue. Like I'm doing this already for three, four, this is season three, vlog 252, I think. So for three years and a half, I'm not stopping. Like if I lose the internet connection, then maybe it will be delayed. But so far I've uploaded every single day, no matter what I did, this will continue. I just love it. I don't want to break that streak. I will continue. I'm sharing here on this channel. My life as a DJ and producer from start to eventually one day finish when I retire. And especially during this time, I will of course continue. Um, we'll do live streaming. I um, will start live streaming once I'm done recording this. First test live stream, so please hit the notification bell thing if you're interested. I will produce and record every single step of a new song that I'm working on. I got a top line, I will work on that and share every single little bit of it. Maybe two, three hours per day. I think around probably five p.m. German time. Should be in the morning in the US, in Asia later at night. Um, basically two, three hours later than I usually upload my vlogs. During those tough times, I, I talk to my team what we can do to support, support music producers. So first up, we're doing, we continue doing the giveaways every Friday. We might not be able to ship anything to you, 
So we will basically do more software plugins giveaways for you guys on my Instagram. If you're interested, go follow there. It will pop up there every single Friday. For software, probably multiple copies, so your chance to win is actually more likely. And this Friday, we're doing a big one, probably the last hardware one, um, KRK Rocket speakers. I think one pair for someone on this planet. So if you don't have a pair of speakers and need one for being locked inside, go there, check it out. Some people rumored I will like monetize um, or, or do like just like special courses, but of course everything is staying for free. My financial situation is all right. I, I can't believe that I'm saying this, but my job isn't at high risk. It's still at risk. Everyone's job is at risk at the moment except for people making toilet paper, maybe. I will also start gaming, probably. I bought a PS4 sitting at home, waiting for me to play with it. I got FIFA 2020. Um, I'll post probably like later this week my, my tag, like ID, so you can like invite me and we can play together. We'll live stream it. So me, you, FIFA, Everyone else can watch, basically. Just to have some entertainment and, and make these tough times easier for everyone. Because there are a lot of people that live alone and like being alone for a month is really, really shitty. Even if you have internet, Wi-Fi connection and, and like a lot of Netflix and stuff like that. But um, yeah, we'll, we'll be online streaming buddies for a while. By the way, let me know which kind of games you're interested in. I was thinking about playing Zelda, the Ocarina of Time one, the best one, the best game ever. I just love it. I haven't played it in a long, long while. I might play World of Warcraft Classic if things get really boring, because that game is very addicting, at least to me, because I played the original back then and I just love it. Um, FIFA, of course and maybe what was it like call of duty the new one i'm not a shooter fan to be honest but maybe i'll give it a try anything else oh yeah the big one as you know i have a sub label it's called sign up it's like a, a label for for young producers for upcoming producers and it's Basically, you upload your song. We help you with the promotion a little, as much as we can with our playlist, and give you this way a little boost. And we're reducing the price heavily to just 30 euros per song, and for 10 years. So 10 years, your song will be distributed through us to Spotify and all other platforms, including Bport and you will get 100% of that money. I calculated yesterday evening quite long for how low we can actually offer it so that we not actually lose money, but for the 30, we will actually lose money. I'm, I'm, I'm doing this to really help to get music of you guys out there. We're not making a profit. I mean, if you just think about it, 30 euros for 10 years, making sure you get your money, your statements, and putting your song up there, plus the promotion. This is really like giving back, because without you guys, I couldn't do what I'm doing. And also make sure that once you're locked down at home, you still have a possibility to release your music. I will link down below in the description, the email, just get in touch, send your song, and we'll figure something out to get your music out there if you're interested to release your music and you think it's good enough and finished enough. This offer is honestly just for this period, for these tough times. I don't know for how long this will be a tough time. One of my employees is taking care of all of the organizational stuff. And yeah, for all the haters, I'm really trying this to, to help. Because like, if it would be about money, there are other things I could do. I got like, at the moment, I'm getting so many offers for ghost producing because all of the big or yeah, like medium to big DJs, they can't tour. A lot of them are not producers. A lot of them are just like figures on a stage that 
basically do nothing. And they need songs at the moment. So it's a good time for ghost producers. It would be easy money. So this is really trying, trying to help the people watching. I hope this is appreciated. If you're interested, I'll link it all down below. If you want to get feedback, um, check out the streams coming up in a couple of, like tomorrow, tomorrow. Actually, once you watch this, two or three hours later, I'll start a small stream, maybe with some feedback. Thanks a lot for watching. Tomorrow, another vlog. Stay strong, guys. Sign up.